Coming up, I'm gonna show you how I carry my extra batteries in my hunting and my camping pack. So stick around. Hey, it's the OCD Hunter bringing you tips, tricks, DIY hacks, and other useful ways that my OCD can help make your life a little bit more simpler. Today, I just wanna show you how I carry my extra batteries with me because it's annoying to carry the batteries in the box that they come from because inevitably they fall out and I don't want to spend money on those plastic cases because they rattle and make noise so I'm just going to show you how I carry my batteries so I don't have to worry about the battery discharging and they're convenient and easy to use. So in this case this is my get home bag and what's in it's really not important it's special to me or specific to me but i'm going to show you how i carry my batteries now like all my tips there it's it's not rocket science it's just to make my life a little bit easier now the first thing i do is i only carry the batteries that I have something on me as a backup. I have two items that require a total of four trip double A, and then I have three items that require three triple A. So I don't carry anything extra. I just carry what I need. And what I've done is I've taken inner tube and I've wrapped them in the groups that they get used as. And then when I need them, I can just reach in and grab and get them. As for the size of the inner tube, I have no idea what size I got. It's not very big, as you can see, so it's probably, I don't know, it's probably an inch and a half in diameter. Um, because you remember, you have the ability to stretch and you want it to be tight and I simply just cut off a piece to go over the top and then a very small piece to wrap around to hold it in place. Here's some triple A's. What I've got is I cut just a really small piece and you know, I think some people call these Ranger bands and spend a lot of money online for them, but whatever. I'm, I'm not into spending a lot of extra money, I'd rather buy one of these and it will last a lot longer and it'll give me a lot more. And then I have access to my batteries. Now, the nice thing about this is I don't have to worry about them discharging because they're not gonna be touching anything metal. And I just simply cut a piece long enough for them to go in. And sometimes it's fun to get them in and slide each battery in. And then I cut the smaller piece that basically is like a belt that just wraps around and secures it into place. They're organized, all easy to find. When I need to open one up for my flashlight, I know that there will always be two together for it. And when it comes to my bag, rather it's my hunting bag, my camping bag, my get home bag, I always put it in the same place. So this is how I carry my spare batteries. So I keep them organized, easy to find, and I don't have to worry about them discharging. They're not in those plastic cases that rattle and make a lot of noise. So I hope this helps. Well, there you have it. I hope that this tip helped you out. I'm the OCD Hunter and I hope that my continual painstaking practice of changing, fixing, and improving on ideas will help you out in your endeavors. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Click the bell next to the subscribe button to get notified of new videos. Remember, comments are always welcome.